All right, y'all, I got the sledge all fixed up. Let's uh, give it a quick rip. I did put the aluminum shot caps on it. Sorry for the wind, y'all. I'm just tempted to break this thing. Just not used to this radio at all. Well, that was a durability test. About to took myself out, boys. Once again, sorry about the wind, y'all. Figure, man. If it survives this beating, I'm going to put the back flips on it. I think these are just a little too soft for my liking. Yeah, there's something ain't happy in there. <laughs> Alright y'all, it's after the bash, taking a quick look at it. I can't tell, but that chassis looks pretty straight to me. Y'all can see it. I don't know what the clanking was in there. I had some rocks. This wire did get chewed up a little bit because it got stuck down in the pinion. I'm going to tear it apart anyway and take a look. I think I had a tire loosen up as well. I might have stripped the servo horn because my steering got way off. Oh, that's what's up. Bolts loosened up. See that on the steering? Anyway, y'all, can run different batteries in this rig. You just have to modify it a little bit. I'm running a 4000 Ma Z battery 60C. I had to put another little cushion up front. The one that came with it I shoved in there and just a piece of uh, yoga mat up on top. She works out good. All right y'all till the next one. Be safe. Peace out. All right, y'all, just got done running the Traxxas sledge. Had a pretty decent run with it. I wanted to get out the Creighton 6S and give it a blast. Kind of feel for myself. Between the two, I know how the Creighton runs. I just want to do it back to back. Same day, same environment. Windier than all hell. I did just realize when I was putting my pack in, though, that I got a broke bolt on the wing bracket that goes into the bulkhead. But it is what it is.
little crate and that could choo choo. Whoa, I lost my phone. Look at that hole right there. Holy moly, I think. What do y'all think? Y'all tell me. Tractus or Arma? So. Oh, there goes the wing. <laughs> LVC baby, and she's running. She wants her wing back. Not too shabby. Drive her up to the house. All right, y'all. Got back up to the house. See what happened. Oh, the body got a little jacked up. The wing broke. I had one bolt that was already broke before I even got started. Cut that joker off. Oh, she, she hot. Yeah, this ball here was broke to start. That M2C tower support kept it from all coming apart. If I wouldn't have had that, we would have had a catastrophic failure. Yeah, she's good. The chassis straight as a board. If I was going bashing, I only had one rig I could take. I would take her broken with no wing over the sledge. I'm not saying I don't like the sledge. I do like her. I like her a lot. I think she's going to look good on my shelf. Until some people start making some products for it. We need a chassis, we need a motor mount, we need gears, shock caps, piston, chassis braces. Basher Queen's already coming up with some pretty hot stuff right now. I think she's doing some towers. She made it where we can put this body and body support stuff on the Creighton. How awesome is that? With the proper adjustments, this will be a, an awesome basher just like the Creighton. All right, y'all. If you like what I'm doing, please like, subscribe, share. Definitely leave me a comment. Until next time, happy bashing, y'all. Stay safe. Don't forget to get that booster shot. Wear your mask. Catch you on the next one.